there you can kind of see where the Charles River Station is set up. We're in the home stretch. Rolling with the seagulls. going to be like when they start seizing this up but it's evidently going to mainly be on weekends and because of the various deficits the MBTA faces from the big dig and the fact that we are badly afflicted with Norquist syndrome such as this here more Norquist syndrome here. It's Norquist syndrome as far as the eye can see. The pitted, scarred, and rotted infrastructure so the chiseling dickheads can dodge taxes while beggaring their neighbors and seeking something for nothing. The mighty trilogy of American life. Dodge taxes, beggar your neighbor, and ever seek something for nothing. It's like a fairy tale from a culture that can't fucking grow up. <laughs> That was fairly pleasant. Didn't take too long. We'll slip down this side of the thing and see what sort of options we have for getting onto the Charles. Huh. We'll skirt some edge of Beacon Hill, I guess. Oh, this is all closed up. Wow. Forget it, we won't bother with this little maze. Let's see what it's got going on. Ooh, you can go underneath, let's try it. Looks like they've got more construction stuff set up. Oh, there's a really bad bit of Norquist disease. Look at that little rotting mess. Oh, some pretty scary rock cradles. Oh, and look at that. It's got serious Norquist. Yes. Whatever is this? <laughs> Some weird little something. Now, is it possible? What happens when we try to go under this thing? I don't want you camping. <laughs> Oh, 
What a mess. So this didn't really go anywhere useful. But the sun is out after being masked by clouds for several days. So I guess the game plan is probably crossing over at the special bridge that was instigated by none other than Dr. Paul Dudley White, I think the fellow's name was, a heart surgeon. So yeah, this is just some mess that will probably linger for a while. And we're at the lower end of Little Wretched Beacon Hill. Oh boy, what is this? Some sort of furnace, I guess, or something for the railroad system. Looks like they've had to do a bunch of preservation work here. Ooh, yeah, there's a walkway system. Yeah, this used to be sort of scruffy. Now it's just another yuppie pit from hell. Yeah, looks like we got a walkway here. And these wildly popular rent-a-bike things. So yeah, we came from there. Okay, this is the side, the western side that will be demolished or dismantled first. And that should be coming up pretty soon. This is the one where I used to play saxophone long ago. It was pretty cool. And now we're almost out of here. We'll get a couple of glimpses of where the subway goes to Underworld and we're done. And there's one of the work barges. And over here, Yawning gate to the underworld. Right there below. That's where the subway is gonna go. The yawning gate to the underworld. From which the train emerges.